Hey everyone, so I'm here with a really quick shivs trick free, or shivs tricks, yeah shivs tricks, I haven't done one in ages so I kind of forget what it's called, but, so one thing that I was thinking of when I was doing my makeup there at the weekend is the sequence with which I apply my different makeup products, facial products, and one thing that I think is really beneficial is to apply your foundation um, first and then go ahead and do your eyes. And then once that's done, come back and powder it once you've given your foundation a good while to settle into the skin. There's a few reasons for this. Number one would be to um, allow that if there's any fallout from your eye makeup that you won't have set your foundation. So if you do need to clean up a little bit, it's gonna be much easier, much less trouble on yourself. You can just use your um, foundation brush that has a little bit of foundation to clear away any of the mess and then just top up really quickly. Another thing that it allows you to do is it allows the foundation just to kind of settle into the skin. Because I find if you powder this foundation straight away after applying it, the foundation is still very wet on the skin and you end up just like mixing the foundation in with the powder rather than just like setting it with the powder. So it can lead to that slightly more cakey problem that some people can have a problem with. So I definitely think it's worth your while letting the foundation just settle into the skin for a good few minutes before you found you before you powder it. And also you might find that you just don't need you find that you might need as much powder um after even sometimes I'll leave it up to a half an hour if I'm not leaving the house first of all. I'll see a few areas that might have the first hints of a bit of a shine. I'll powder them and if I don't need to powder anywhere else, I won't. And, and also then, when it comes to concealer, if you're applying concealer to any blemishes or any areas like that, definitely let that set for a good 30 seconds to a minute if you can before powdering it. Again, it just means that it's not going to grab onto that powder as much and it kind of just sets itself um, and allows it to just do its own thing and settle into the skin and let the warmth of the skin just let it absorb in as much as it will if you know what I mean onto the skin and then use your powder lightly press it on over it so by pressing your powder onto it it'll really keep it in place and then wipe off any excess and I just find that's the best way of applying it so um try that the next time you're doing your foundation apply your foundation and you can even do a bit of concealer if you want and then go ahead and do your eyes and come back and powder afterwards and see how you get on and see if you've noticed any difference or if you find that maybe it allows the powder to go on nicer and stuff like that so i hope this was helpful it's a tip that really helps me and i'll chat to you soon for another video as long guys